Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be going over how to get the Dropbox app to work on Linux. So to start off, just go to dropbox.com. You don't even really need to sign in yet. You just click the download button. It's going to show you this install page, and of course if you don't understand any of the directions here, please just check out our link below. And uh, I go over this in much greater detail than the Dropbox site does. But uh, as I'm using Debian, I'm going to need to download the Ubuntu Deb. And uh, I'm using 64-bit, so I'll need to click this button here. And Dropbox will download. I'm going to install it with GDebi because it's fast. Just click on it to open it. My package manager will let me click install and it will quickly install straight to my system. Now, there's also terminal instructions. If you're looking for that, you can please check the description and I will break that down for you. But uh, once it's installed, you can close the package installer, search for Dropbox in your application launcher. And uh, now I'm already signed into Dropbox, so I'm gonna need to sign out so I can show you how that all works. But uh, just click unlink and uh, that should fix it. So let me reopen Dropbox. Oh, okay. So I'm not signed in. So when you first launch the app on Linux, it's gonna open up a browser tab like this. You just click the sign in button, continue to Dropbox. It'll load their website, which no one cares about. And then from there, you can just download all of your stuff. And uh, go to preferences, you can see the syncing stuff and uh, go through if you'd like to selectively sync, which I'm going to do because I don't need this downloaded. I click update and it will go through and it'll only download what I wanted to download and it will all be in my Dropbox folder here. And as you can see, I've got some video files here from previous videos that you guys have seen. Uh, a little sneak peek behind the curtain, but yes, uh, so my Dropbox is ready to be used. And that's exactly how you get it going. It's super easy. Uh, Dropbox is one of the most easy to use systems on Linux for cloud storage. It's super impressive. I really love this tool. Uh, so anyways, I'm going to get going, but just a quick video on how to get Dropbox working on Linux. See you guys in the next video.